Hi, I'm Casey and I am so excited. This is my first ever video on YouTube. Now, I've tried to upload other videos, um, but I was on a different camera and I wasn't able to upload them. But I'm so excited. Okay, so this video is just going to be a face makeup video and I'll just be doing cover up, concealer, you know, powder, BB cream, stuff like that. No makeup, eyes, or eyebrows. <clears throat> right. So, first of all, I just want to say I already did my eyeliner earlier today for my makeup and I just couldn't get it off. So, that's fine. Okay. So, the first thing that we're going to start off with is a Alma Clear Complexion Love and Shield Neutral 400. And I purchased this at Walmart and I really like it. I do, um, um, encourage you guys to get it. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to put some on my hand, and I'm just going to take my finger and just put dots around my face with it. And, um, this makeup, I, um, like it because it gives me that <coughs> clear complexion, like it says in the title. I don't have any shine on my face or anything. I really like it. Okay, so I'm going to rub this in with a little cosmetic round, which I got at Walmart in a pack of like 12 for like 99 cents, and I really like it. Right, so what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to rub it in, um, this makeup is um, when you add a lot, like if you add more than you're supposed to, like, um, sometimes I can't even add, um, more than half a squirt sometimes and my face decides to be lighter one day because it decides that it wants to look like it's coated on. <clears throat> so, that makeup is kind of eerie. But, um, for my nose, under eyes, eyes, and uh, my mouth, I'll be using a blending brush with already have some good seal on it. And I'm just going to dot that around where I have blemishes. And I'm actually just going to take a little bit of a squirt. Like barely, about that much. I'll just take a little bit of it and put it where I need it. And this, I'm just putting this where my acne is. Oh, I know they say it's not good to put makeup um, over your acne, but this makeup is so healthy to me that it really doesn't matter. So, I really like to put it on. Um, I forgot to say this, but before I put all this on this morning, um, all you need is to put a little bit of this on in the morning, and you're good to go all day before you put on your makeup, but it's a Face Expert BB Cream that I purchased at Icing and I really like it it's just the perfect amount of um, lotion and to me it seems more of a lotion than a BB cream which is which is different than a lot of the BB creams I've tried and I really like it so if you're ever at Icing make sure to pick that up oops I'm sorry okay the next thing is going to be a Maybelline New York cover stick and this is in a medium beige and I really like it. It comes with that, that much. I've used a lot of it. And I got this at Walmart. They have it in a lot of colors. But this is my color. Because you want to get a light one. From your skin. And I'm just putting this on like the one that all it. Which you probably can't see on the camera. But there's a lot of them. Alright. So I'll be using a blending brush for some of them. And then on the major ones, I'm just going to be using my finger. And I like to put, put it under my eyes because it gets rid of dark circles or anything that you need to blemish. Um, when you blend it in, you need to make sure you really blend it in or else you will have white marks. But your powder will probably take care of that. 
so it depends really if you have a good powder, how good you use blender in. Alright. And I'm just taking out oh, my eyes that I'm just taking like the blending brush and just blending it in where it's not going to be done very good. Okay. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my powder. It's a Alme Clear Complexion Pressed Powder. It's a um two hundred light medium skin. And um I really like this. Um it was out of the rare rare collection and I saw it there. It was on sale and I, it's my skin. You can't really see this. It looks a little light, but it is. And with this I like to use an ego tools brush. I got this at Walmart with same with this and this, my powder. It's an Eco Tools brush. It's called a doomed, doomed Bronzer. And I use it more for blush than bronzer. And I really like it. So I'm just going to take the powder and just uh, rub it all over my face. And I'm going to really want to vanish that white mark up on my forehead. Okay, so there we go. Oops. Okay, so the next thing that we're going to do is bronzer. Um, the bronzer that I use is the NYC Color World Mosaic Face Powder. And this is in choose, and this is a translucent Highlighter Glow. I use this for both highlighter and bronzer. I really like it. I got it at Walmart. And with this, I'll be using an icing blusher or icing powder brush and I don't use this for my powder because it's too big for my powder but I think it's a perfect size for this so I'll just be taking some of this and rubbing it and this really makes you have a finished look um I would rather purchase rather have purchased the the darker ones but um this one works just as fine. Okay. Now I'll be using the NYC Color Wheel Mosaic Face Powder Brush Blush, and this is in Color Wheel, or <laughs> and this is in 723A Pink Cheek Glow. And I really like it because it has darker colors in it. And with this, I'm just going to be taking an angled blusher I have purchased from um, Walmart, and just take a little bit of this and. Really get my hairline. Sorry if the camera is not adjusting good. It's on autofocus, but sometimes it doesn't like to adjust. Okay, the next thing that we we will be doing is um. Nothing. We are all done with that. I really hope you liked my face tutorial. And we are really all done. Um, I know that I just said that it's supposed to be a concealer one, so here we go. And I will be doing eyeshadow um, tutorials, more of these tutorials if I, when I get new stuff. Lip tutorials, blush tutorials, bronzer, I, anything you can think of. Comment below the stuff that you want me to... The, videos I would like me to do and I promise my next ones will be mm, better but I this is my first one so I hope you enjoyed it and um, I will see you soon. Bye.